Yo, what's yo, going what's on? Up, man? How you I been, man. Right. Yo, last night was crazy, yo, dude. dude. Like, off the hook. We took it to a whole nother so level. Fresh. We got so fat. So but, like, dude, like, what's on your agenda for this week? Like, what you got going on? Um, Essays, like, you know, exams. Like, what's going on, man? Oh, my God, dude. I got an exam tomorrow. What? You know what? What, well, dude? Like, I'm so unorganized. I don't know what's going on, dude. I have no idea. That's it. I'm going. Oh, no. Come on. Guys, you haven't heard about the new app? No, what new app? It's called Silly Sing. It syncs all your syllabuses and it keeps me really organized. What? What? No. Okay. So, the problem with Silly Sing is is this time management. Time management is a crucial part of college life. Uh, an organized college student has a higher chance of success if they are organized and well prepared for all classes. Be organized is that you have an idea of what assignments are due, what assignments are coming up, and having that ability allows you to prepare adequately for them. A lot of the times, college students don't have this don't have this kind of thing figured out just yet. So what they fall back on is cramming and a lot of those kind of issues that result in poor grades or a poor experience in college. So the student body at Rutgers, being our target market, offers a wide variety of different people who have different studying methods. Silicon aims to fix that problem by having an app that organizes all schedules and syllabuses. All right, so the app operates via web crawler, which downloads the syllabuses and professor updates, which is unique to this app. And everything is pretty much just placed into the app and organized by due date in class. And this gives the students a peace of mind when it comes to scheduling and working. More than $50,000 right off the bat to get the app developed. Uh, we've had very high profit margins in this business because once, uh, once the cost of the development was taken out, we would have a profit margin of about 77%. Um, we're also looking at a really high premium that we'd be able to charge for Headspace. Most apps uh, charge about 2 to $3 for every thousand people that uh, see the ad. Uh, we'd be able to charge about $12 um, for every thousand people that see the ad because we know exactly who's looking at it. It's a very specific uh, customer base. Um, we estimate our revenue at about $108,000 every year. Uh, so, you know, once the cost, again, is taken out, we're looking at a really high profit margin and almost no cost to run. Yo! Yo what's so what do you got on tap for this week, man? Well, this week, you know, I got an assignment tomorrow, I got an exam today, what is next week? Wow, you're all organized? Oh, you got that silly sink out, dude? Wow! Yeah, dude! I'm now so we can frack! Yeah!